and welcome to Star Wars Obsessed. Two years ago, I saw my brother, and he said that he has a lot of action figures that he can give me. Technically, they are not his. They actually belong to his partner's girlfriend's son. His, her son is about 30 years old. So he was collecting Star Wars when he was a lot younger, and he doesn't want them anymore, so now they're going to give them to me. So they didn't have him with him at the time when I saw him, so I said, all right, well, how about sending me pictures whenever you get back home? And so he got back home and never, nothing happened. And I said, so what, where's the figures? He says, oh, I can't find them. They're up in storage or in the attic. And I said, Ugh. so how about sending me a picture when you find them? And nothing. He comes to visit us for Thanksgiving, and I said, so, where are the action figures? And he says, oh, he totally forgot them. And I said, so, do you really have these action figures? He says, yes, they have them. So, recently, my brother came down, and he brought the figures. So, here they are in this bag. Now, I have actually seen them, because it kind of would have been rude if I had just been like, hey, thanks, bye. So I took them out and I looked at them and there were some Star Trek in there. So I was like, here, take these. So I'm going to open one of these bags and show you what I got. Try to go through this as quick as I can. So I got a Han Solo and Carbonite with the figure. Woohoo! I actually have this on card and I, for a while I was debating, hey, maybe I should take it off the card. But now I don't have to because I got this. All right, what's next? I got this accessory that belongs to EV99. Awesome. Okay, I also have this on card. And I got this Mace Windu. Okay, this accessory, I have no idea what it is. This accessory, I have no idea what it is. Let's see. Oh, the... 90s version when did this come out uh 1997 of a rebel soldier very very muscular and i think i have this on card as well and this is from the special edition 1997. let's see oh a gamorian guard from 1997 very big. Very big Gamorrean Guard. I wonder if it's bigger than the um, one from the 80s. I'm curious. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check that out. Here it is. Comparison. Huh. It is kind of bigger. Alright, let's keep going. I got a 2-1-B medical droid. Got a a Tuscan Raider. Got a Tuscan Raider. Ooh, an actual vintage figure. Awesome. And it's as far as I know, it's complete. Well, not complete. Didn't have a weapon. But yay! I love the vintage. Let's see. Oh, this is a wind-up clone trooper. It's uh, Burger King and 2005. And a TIE Fighter. Looks like Darth Vader's TIE Fighter. 2005. And it just, it's on wheels, so it rolls. And this is. Who is this? It's Valorum, and it came out in 1998. There we go. It's better. I'm using my computer so the camera quality doesn't seem to be that great. Got C-3PO and it's one of those those things where you can look at the picture. Can I get close enough to see it? Nope. You look inside, oh, it goes this way. You look inside, and where does it click? Then you turn, it's like a view master, and you see the pictures.
so cool. Okay, some more. Oh, a Boba Fett. And I have no idea what this does. There's a push button on the back. And it seems like something was supposed to go in here. It does this and then comes down, but... So, no idea. So I see uh, the gaffy stick for the sand trooper. And a lightsaber. Like maybe for Mace Windu. Wait, he had a purple one. Huh. That's not good. What's up with that? But yeah, this one been his. This is per his was no wait, was it purple? Can't remember now. And something, don't know what that's for. Okay, this bag is empty. Now I have a. Looks like I have a patron, a cantina patron. It is. This is who's this? Elors Madak. Another one to add to the cantina. Very cool. And it looks like it wasn't even played with because the rubber band is still on it. But I can add this to my cantina display. What else? Oh! It's the over-muscular Luke Skywalker! Oh, this is pretty cool. Get out. It's the clear... Uh, this is Micro Machines? Let's see. I don't know what it is. I think it's Micro Machines. The sand color that you can see inside. So cool. Okay. What else? What else? What else do we have? We have one of these things. A Geonosian, Geonosian warrior. You know, I didn't collect any figures from the prequels, so these are all new to me. So, pretty cool. And it has this really cool weapon. That it holds somehow. What else? We have Turn that out. Count Dooku, Dark Lord da Count Dooku, and with a Darth Sidious hologram. Let's see. Okay, so this is is lightsaber slightly bent is he why does that look like oh he's got slashing action cool here we go slash 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 yeah take that take that Put his cape on. There we go. What is this? This is Anakin Skywalker with his missing arm. It has a wheel on the back. Oh, his wheel the wheel turns his arm. Interesting. Or his hand. It turns his hand. Hanger duel. It looks like they were going that they wanted to sell these things because some of them have prices on them. 
that's not a price. This says Royal Grand. This is pretty cool because it has an attachment. His hand, his arm attaches magnetically. That's a pretty cool touch right there. I like that. But I, I think he's supposed to have two lightsabers. Because this one goes here. It spins. Oh, it doesn't want to turn. What? What's going on here? Bends there. Well, his hand turns, but won't turn with the lightsaber. Oh, this still has a rubber band on it. But oh, I like these that they, that you can take the the actual blade out of the of the hilt. He doesn't actually hold this lightsaber. Unless he's he is handed damage. I don't know where I'm going to to put all these figures. I have all this, all my figures displayed. I need to look for more space. Yeah, see, this one says can't get those three dollars. So looks like they were having yard sale, and I got a my very first Darth Maul with soft goods. Doesn't have a lightsaber, it just has the hilt of his saber. But, and I'll admit, Darth Maul is pretty cool looking. Alright, what's next? It is Qui-Gon Jinn. Qui-Gon Jinn. Interesting pose for Qui-Gon Jinn. Um, where did this come out? Another one from 98. Um, I'm assuming that he's supposed to have a, a, a blade. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's here somewhere. And I have a Luke and Dagobah outfit from the 90s. Look how buff that is. What is this? Okay, I don't really know which one this is. Is it Nuke Gunray? Oh no, not another one. Yeah. So. Oh, I have another Leia, Jabba Slave Leia, with her weapon. I can put this one on the barge. And I have another Mace Windu. He's doing something. Oh, interesting. This does something. And in this bag includes a a battle droid. In pieces, I'm assuming. Yeah. A battle droid in pieces. And a a weapon. I think I'm assuming that's for the battle droid. Come on out. There we go. I'm assuming it goes like that. I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> Leia's cape. <laughs> what is this now? It is a Jedi. It is Kit Fisto. With a lightsaber. This one. Legs are in an interesting position. So always in this in this action pose. Something's going on. 
Everything's flailing about. Let's see, what do we have here? I have an Obi-Wan Kenobi. With his arm out, so he does something. That's it. His arm goes up, lightsaber goes out. There we go. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Almost to the end. <laughs> I got a Greedo. Greedo from 1996. So Power of the Force 2 Greedo. With both of his weapons. And... Ooh, they were selling something for $10. I think this. The Ishi Tib. Okay, Ishi Tib that I I also have carded. And last but not least, I have an Emperor's Royal Guard from the 1997 Power of the Force 2 collection. Well, that's it for my latest haul. And I really thank my brother and his girlfriend for giving me these figures. It's pretty awesome. I didn't collect any of the prequel stuff, so I think it's kind of cool having these in my collection now. He did mention that they have more, so he didn't say what they were. He, you know, he didn't know. He doesn't know much about Star Wars, so he didn't know what they were. If they were vintage or more like 90s and 2000s, but it, I can't wait to see. I'm, I'm pretty excited to see what he had, what more they have. And I hope it doesn't take another two years. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then give it a thumbs up and click subscribe. Also, click on that bell icon to be alerted to new videos. You can also check out more of my collection at the Star Wars Obsessed blog.